I'm a lecturer in Public and Creative Histories at the University of Bristol. One of the main findings and one of the things that really surprised me was just how extensive this use of gas was. Um, it created what you might think of as the first true nighttime economy with those sort of that lighting allowing you to sort of stay out later in different places and, and things could be lit and streets could be lit main the main streets in Bristol were lit quite quickly um, in the 1820s um, but also the fact that it sort of extended so so widely across the population or at least it did sort of as that developed so around about 1900 um, they had this uh, thing called a prepayment meter so you could sort of pay a certain amount and that was the amount of gas that you wanted to use so you didn't have to worry about when the gas bill would would sort of appear and that you might get have to spend more than you thought and that really extended it to um, the working classes around about 1900 so it became a really big um, a really big aspect of people's lives um, heating mainly um, in in their homes and cooking their dinners um, as well as its many sort of industrial uses. Uh, gas was used in um, the Wills Tobacco Factory, it was used in Filton Aeroplane Company, it was used in uh, uh, the Fry Chocolate Company, and it was used sort of in so many different aspects of industrial life within the city of Bristol that you just don't really think about, I suppose. I suppose some of the things that surprised me was just that tension between the excitement about it and the fear about it. So one of the early things they did to really advertise gas as this exciting technology of the future was a, a, a balloon, uh, a balloon ride from from St Philip's. Um, that sort of you know a gas gas filled balloon that they could sort of take away across, um, as well as sort of that the ideas and you see this in different bits of the newspapers, um, the reports that were quite very regular of. Um, injuries of fear of 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 death um, from different gas explosions and the investigations that the gas company then sort of had to go through um, to try and work out how to make some of this technology safer. Um, I suppose another parallel um, which I thought about is is the environmental one. So we've talked a little bit about um, the sort of the environmental pollution that's created from from the gas works and. Um, it being right on a canal that had um, sort of implications for that and gas works worked on basically a principle of shifting the site of pollution so if you are cooking on a fire in your house the smoke is then within your house but if you are using gas it's very it's cl much cleaner within your house you've shifted the pollution from your house to a gas works and digital innovation works on a, on a similar basis in some ways now um, it's all very clean and sleek at the point of use um, which will be the new BDFI building, um, but that obviously is based upon pollution and um, sort of extractive technologies in different parts of the world, the mining for different parts of smartphones, um, the creation of electricity itself in, in power plants. Again, it's shifted that site of pollution. So I think that's a very interesting thought to think about sort of going forward where some of that energy and um, sort of work and that pollution is coming from and going to. Yeah, so, th so this is the, the, the step of the project that we're really excited about now. We'd really like to hear um, anyone's stories about this area and about the gasworks. So if you worked at the gasworks, we'd love to hear what, what life was like working there. If you had a parent who maybe worked at the gasworks, it'd be lovely to sort of hear any memories or that they shared or talked about or thought um, with you about things like that um, and, if, and of course if you have any sort of pictures or anything like that that would be absolutely fantastic to sort of see a bit more about what daily life was like about more what the gas works meant to people in that community and, uh, and sort of trying to go forward um, sort of try and incorporate some of those stories um, so yeah it'd be lovely to sort of share some of those um, stories um, in the